somehow got myself to a situation where I'm stranding myself on a little island, on a bigger island. It's in the middle of nowhere with an old dude that I met a couple weeks ago who just so happened to be a, a surf legend back in the day on this atoll and a bunch of other atolls in the Pacific. <laughs> So, I am incredibly upset. My uh, new Rode microphone is already failing me, and I lost a lot of footage because lots of that footage has absolutely no sound or just a super loud screeching noise, which is very upsetting. <laughs> Anyways, um, I, I can sometimes play with it and it sometimes works, but uh, you know, it's it's very iffy off and on about 50% of the time. Um, so Chuck somehow arranged for a, one of the local schools at a village to all get together this afternoon after school, and I'm going to get a big drone shot of them screaming, Welcome to Fanning Island, as I fly away, and it's, it's going to be sick. So hopefully this microphone works then, or, uh, or else I'll be probably cry on all honesty I'd probably cry so we uh, arranged with the local school to have all the school kids get together after school and we're gonna get a little drone shot of them and the clips of the, all the kids screaming welcome to Fanning Island the moment the principal of the junior secondary school figured that out because we were um, beating around the bush about when we could do it and things and he stopped us right there and said, um, school, school gets out at 3.30, but I'm going to uh, make this a special event. And we'll have the kids uh, do this at 2.30 sharp, and then they'll go back to class. So 2.30 sharp, they're going to come out. They're going to be all gathered together. Mm -hmm. We're going to get a good sound bite and then turn on the flying camera. Woohoo, we're special. Th this little sound bite today is to get something organized so that when the mayor sees it, Tomorrow, he'll be moved to say something to the uh, to the counselors. We need the mayor's blessing, and today's um, today's little bit is the beginning to get the mayor's blessing. We look like a bunch of professionals with all our camera gear and whatnot. What I'd like to do, yeah, stop being a tourist carrying my water. Wait one minute here, and I'll just. Huh, fair enough. Oh yeah, right there? That's a good spot. Alrighty. Welcome to Fanning Island. Yes, Fanning Island. Fanning Island. One, two, three, four, five. Welcome to Fanning Island. Woo!
Well, that was pretty awesome. I found out afterwards that my camera overheated and I'm hoping that uh, it didn't overheat before I got the, the shot that I needed or else that would be a negative situation. I have a somehow arranged an expedition to take me to the other side of the lagoon. It's entirely uninhabited and uh, drop me off so I can spend a few days and it's gonna be gonna be crazy. Looks like it's rush hour. <laughs> Check here? Right over here? Oh, hey, Chuck. You in here? I, I just saw, what's his name? He's gonna really? give us a ride, he's looking for you, I think. Really? I don't know. Oh, I just came, came to see you. Okay. Ready? Oh, good, yes. Okay, see you over there. See ya. Yep, we're going camping. With, with you, with, with you. With me. And with Chuck. You. Chuck. Yep. Chuck, Chuck and me. Yep, Chuck and me. We're going camping. Where are you going? I'm going back home. Back home? Hello, girl. How can you ride that bike? That's impressive. Chuck and I got all our bags packed up and we're uh, heading to the marina where we're gonna get dropped off by boat on some part of the atoll that's uninhabited and we're gonna do some soul searching and whatnot. Have a great time, right Chuck? That's right. <laughs> we're gonna go on two trips. Two. A, a soul trip and a travel trip. Exactly. A trip of a um of a new of a new con of exploring new new paradigms new consciousness that new consciousness is the it? error that i the error that i missed growing up in the <laughs> 60s mid, mid 60s and all those guys were above me <laughs> and all the all the stuff that went around to say how whatever it was you're just too busy surfing i was busy surfing and i, I i'm 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 not following the crowd but no, I was religious, so we, you know, you, you absolutely did things the right way. You know, you, you followed the law. Fair enough. And if, if Smokey said, the, Smokey is the law. You know, if he said, you know, it, the, uh, it was wrong. And I remember they scared us about acid, you know, that oh, yeah. you, know, you could go on a trip and just disappear and you just get all fucked up for the rest of your life. Oh, yeah. But I love my mother. I love my daughters and my granddaughters. I love my wife, whom I separated with, and I. I'm ready with clear with um. I've cleaned any skeletons out of my, out of my conscious and subconscious. So. You're ready. And I'm fasting. So. Absolutely. So you're ready to go. I put one post up. I, I post. Yeah. The pre-trip anxiety. Our golden ah. chariot. Big. Bye, kids. Bye. They like me, I think. Chuck is the new boatman. I'm terrified. <laughs> so we're uh, going across the lagoon now to the other side of the atoll and where we're going only Chuck knows because he knows his way around the lagoon apparently. Back in the saddle again. This is like your uh, classical kind of paradise. So I missed my road. My road's over there. Oh, okay. I would. I, I. When I stood up, I needed to go around one more 
one more place and then, then there's a good road that gets me to that point over there. Did you bring your rod? I did. <laughs> you know how to catch bonefish now? Huh? I know how to catch bonefish now. See? So... So we found a, a nice little spot where we're going to be dropped off. Are we walking that way? Yeah, let's walk. Well, I have a first class service going through the lagoon. Got these two fellas hauling my uh, lazy butt through uh, some pristine water here. Yeah, it's a place is something else. We got steam engine Chuck. Our motor broke down, so uh, Chuck's our new engine. Fuck yeah. You excited? Yes sir. Yeah. Really, 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 really excited. Well, I can hear. If there's if there's nobody camped out, we're gonna go to that island there. We're navigating our way through a maze of coral. Hold on, this one's shallow. Oh Billy. Oh no. It's okay, it can touch the bottom. Okay. God, it's a freaking journey getting out of this island. Now, if we came out here in two weeks from now, there'd be a foot of water. A week from now, there'll be a foot of water on top of these coral heads. Wow. And that'll be time for the next one. Oh my gosh, it's shallow. <laughs> yeah, and you can't you can't walk it because it's 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 like 12 feet deep in the holes. Are we going in the right direction, Chuck? Yeah, let's... If there's nobody here, then we'll stay here. Well, this is gonna be a... Island Survival Round 2. <laughs> Willie, I actually made a documentary where I got dropped off on an island and survived for... <laughs> like 10 days by myself. Really? Yeah. Yeah, this is a... Round two, and it's called Boy versus Island. Now it's, I guess, Man versus Island. Bye, camera. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Bruno's been there for, for, for a long, long time. Oh, yeah. See you next week. Yep, see you on Sunday. <laughs> see you on Sunday, buddy. Thanks for bringing us out here. Okay. Enjoy. Good Thank luck. you. God, God bless. <laughs> Woohoo! Our own little island. What do you have well, to say, Chuck? Well, our discussion was. Remember last night the tide was slightly going out. When, yeah. So, the, so the tide advances 45 minutes a day, but the evening tide gets smaller as it moves on. So today, the high tide, the, the change of tides, the change of high tide was 6.45. Tomorrow evening, it's gonna be at 7.30. And on Sunday, it would be at 8.15. And so he may come out here Sunday morning okay. on the morning tide. Yeah, perfect. Uh-oh. 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 So uh, Chuck wandered off down the coast a little ways and I'm just kind of wandering around through this uh, beautiful coconut forest or palm tree forest and 
Just trying to find a nice little spot to set up camp that's out of the sun. And uh, I am stoked to be out here. This place is just beyond, beyond my wildest dreams. I love it.